I'm totally gonna get demonetized for this. What type of bra I'm wearing, so let me just rip it out for you guys. Hi, my sexy penguins. I hope you guys are all having an amazing day or week so far. Today, we're gonna be doing a Boohoo try on haul. I think the last time I bought from Boohoo was like over a year ago. And recently, some of my friends have bought from Boohoo with like such cute items. So, I bought all these items on Boohoo with my own money. I think these were over $300 worth of purchase. And I think I got about nine or 10 outfits in total. So, we're gonna go through them and see which ones are worth the money and which ones to keep and also which ones to return. Oh, I just want to point out that because I'm in Canada, I paid about $16.99 for shipping and it got here about a week, a week and a half or so and there's like zero surprises at the door. I know this sounds like an ad right now, but it's not. Boohoo actually covers all Canadian duties and taxes. So whatever you're paying on the site, like that's it. You will not be hit with any surprise duties at the door. So. That's a good thing to note. Why don't I shop from Boohoo more often? Oh yeah, so first up we have this gorgeous tie-dye sky blue color t-shirt ribbed dress. Let me know if tie-dye is still a thing in 2021. I know it was a huge, huge trend back in 2020 summer, but I've seen some people rocking tie-dyes again this spring. So I hope they bring it back because I'm absolutely in love with this first one. Actually, you know what? Even if tie-dye is not in trend, I'm still gonna wear it because who am I kidding? I freaking love this one. I didn't actually expect to love it as much as I do, but you guys, this is like the ultimate t-shirt dress and it looks like the sky and it feels amazing and comfortable and not see-through. The entire material is made of this like ribbed, super stretchy cotton material. I got this in a size small slash medium. Currently five months pregnant, so this is actually very, very bump friendly for me. And also, you know, very food baby friendly as well. So actually my favorite feature about this dress is that it comes with two side ruched details and drawstrings. That means you can draw it as high or as low as you want. So I think it comes all the way down to my knees if I just like let the whole thing down. But if you want to draw it higher up, it can literally be any length that you want. So very, very digging the versatility of this. The quality just surpassed my expectations from something from Boohoo. So definitely suggest this to every single one of you guys. It's so easy to just throw on in the morning without thinking too much. And it's so easy to pair with any sort of bags or footwear as well. This is a two piece blazer set that actually comes in two separate sizes. So you would purchase the top separately from the bottom. And then the top I got a size US 6 and the bottom I got a US Eight. So the first impression is that this entire outfit is like very like clueless type of outfit giving me really like academia vibes and also like kind of girl boss vibes. First thing that came to my attention was that you need to iron or steam the crap out of this top and the bottom. The top comes with shoulder pads, but I don't know if you guys can tell, but the shoulder pads are not too pronounced and they're actually not very outwards like I don't think they're placed <laughs> at the right position so they're kind of stopped here maybe it's just me and I've got like really weirdly wide shoulders and also it's extremely short this is where my bra is and then this is where it ends so it kind of ends like one or two inch underneath your bra have to be really really careful i suggest you guys to wear like a crop top or some kind of like bandeau underneath this if you don't want to like flash everyone but material is like a really thick and um, sturdy material so it's lined on the inside same for top and the bottom the bottom also has these really cute gold buttons on the sides which i think is really cute and overall pattern it's just like a really classy type of plaid pattern don't like this fact of not having pockets it like kind of teases you with like an opening flap for a pocket but when you open the flap there is nothing like if you're gonna create a pocket flap opening i don't know how hard it would be to just continue creating a real pocket at that point when you're manufacturing the skirt if you had a business that you were passionate about then you would know what it takes to run a business but you don't i feel like i get very very emotionally tied whenever I speak about pockets because it's like a really, really important detail for me. I just get very, very sad every time I find out there's no pocket. 
Overall, I kind of really, really like this set. I like the fact that you can choose sizes for top and bottom separately, and you can also wear the top and the bottom separately too, like they don't have to go together. It makes a match with other pieces in your closet. What do you guys think? Should I keep this or return this? Let me know in the comments down below. I got this. Um, I want to say this is like a porcelain pattern. It reminds me of like my mom's flower face. I got a size US 6 for this two-piece set. And unfortunately, there's no way you can separate um, the sizing for the top and the bottom. Both pieces come in one size. And for me, the top, I don't know. It's a little bit weird. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the boob area this area is very very stretchy so the under boob area is what i'm truly concerned about because it's so small like the fabric itself to contain your boobs is just not enough definitely do not suggest this for people with like bigger boobies out there if you belong to the ibtc then this may work for you with like something like a nipple cover or something but i'm wearing one of those sticky bras and you can totally see it like peek out from underneath here so highly highly suggest you guys to go with lingerie tape or if you don't have something like this just go with double-sided tape it will work tuck the underneath side of here underneath that sticky bra if you don't have the sticky bra in place here it will very very likely right up as you're trying to like move your arms there are two tie strings here one at the top of the bra and one at the bottom of the bra they don't really do much the tie strings are pretty much there just for decor i mean you can cinch them in and stuff but it doesn't change the fact that the booby area is so tiny and okay underneath that we have this button closure of this like one strappy flap going on i kind of like the design of the strappy flap so it's not like um, very very like boob heavy and then you have like a giant gap in between your boob and the start of the bottom and then the bottom skirt here we have just a normal type of skirt this is a zipper closure i'm wearing like a white nude colored underwear today so i'm not sure if you guys can see my underwear through the skirt but yeah just wanted to let you guys know that this top and the bottom is not lined in any way so it does feel pretty thin what do you guys think do you guys like it do you guys hate it if you want to get it make sure you invest in double-sided tape because that's gonna save your life i don't know how else you're gonna wear this okay guys next up we have another two-piece set so this one is a pastel pink two-piece set on camera right now it's looking really really pale and like almost beigey but in real life i promise you it's like a true pastel pink again i must be obsessed with these like tiny boob coveragey tops for some reason because i just can't get enough of them got this also in a u.s size six again both the top and the bottom comes in the same size the material of this is like a can you guys hear it it's like a kind of stiffer material definitely has more structure to it and it's not see-through so the sleeves can be worn on the shoulder or off the shoulder like this and there's a rouge pattern happening all over here again you would just tie this area at the bottom of your bra and i highly highly suggest to wear something like sticky bras which i will also be linking down below and also having some lingerie tape to just hold everything together i think this two-piece set is very multifunctional because you can wear the skirt or the top just on its own paired with something else so that gives you more chances to wear this outfit as opposed to just wearing it for like one or two times the skirt is a really really high-waisted skirt and there's a zipper closure no elastic whatsoever there's there's there, there. i hope you get it together there's a ruche design down the side of the skirt and it comes with this little string here and you would think this is a drawstring guys but it is not a drawstring it has no function it doesn't actually draw so there's no way you can customize this by cinching it like higher or lower so basically it's sewn on the only thing you can do is tie it do you guys think this is like a wearable outfit like where would you wear it to as much as i love this whole set i'm not sure if i actually would want to wear to an occasion where i have to be like constantly thinking about like am i flashing everyone let me know in the comments down below what you think of this outfit and where would you wear it to another two-piece set because i'm obviously obsessed with two-piece sets or coordinates however you want to call them let me know if you call them two-piece sets or cords i think different areas 
of the earth calls them different things. I don't know why I just said earth. I could have said world. Different parts of the world. Different parts of the earth. You know what? It's the same thing, right? <laughs> Pregnancy brain. I'm having coconut water break because I can't have wine break anymore. Looking forward to having the wine breaks back in September. <laughs> okay, so this is a magenta two-piece set. And the material, first off, um, is a very smooth and wrinkle-free material, I do have to add, because that's the first thing I noticed about this. I think it's like a slinky type fabric, um, which is very, very stretchy like this. And it just feels really soft and smooth on the skin. Very, very low maintenance because you don't have to steam it every flipping time you wear it. Got this in a size US 6. This is what it looks like on me. I do love the color. I do love the design. I'm not loving how low cut this is. And the fact that the shoulder straps are non-adjustable. It comes with two side ruche details on the side here. But guess what? It's also not adjustable so yeah these side strings are kind of just for show they don't actually do anything i would advise all of you guys to size down for this set if you really like it because i really do think it runs a little bit larger the skirt i actually really 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 like it fits my baby bump really really well and also has one side with a ruche detail let me see if this ruche detail is adjustable i don't know why brands do this like if you're gonna have a ruche detail on the side can we just make use of it and have it actually draw than it just being like a decor piece this is so easy why can't you just do it right i always get disappointed when i realize that like it doesn't really do anything so yes yeah, digging the elasticity the design the color the feel just not too much the non-drawness of the drawstrings what do you guys think what would you rate this out of 10 let me know in the comments down below another simple ribbed dress this one is a midi dress and it's a mint green color reminds me of like mint ice cream and pistachios and avocados and i'm super thrilled because it actually matches my hair clip for the day which is highly highly satisfying for me really really digging the simplicity of this dress definitely something that again you can throw on in the morning without thinking too much and just go with your whites your basics your blacks for pairing and complementary colors there's a light stretch to this dress but it's not too stretchy I definitely think the first tie-dye blue one was more stretchy than this and this one also has no um, side ruche details for you to like customize it however you want so I still think I prefer the tie-dye blue dress over this dress what do you guys think <gasps> I just found a little hole <gasps> look can you guys see I wonder if I did that or like just came like that because that is not cool. I want to minus like 10 billion trillion points for that hole. Okay, so I paid $20 for this dress, which you know, is not like too bad, but still. Oh, and I know that you guys are always going to be asked what type of bra I'm wearing. So let me just rip it out for you guys right now, live. <laughs> so this is the bra that, oh my God, I'm so sorry. It's like so dirty. Uh, this is the bra that I tend to wear a lot when I do my try on hauls and it's a lifesaver especially for those low cut ones or backless ones go like this and then I really like how the sides are just like a clear sticker it is reusable you just have to wash the sides here with warm water and soap and let the air dry but I will say that the cups come a lot bigger than advertised I think this was like a B cup when I got it and guys I don't think this is a B cup I think this is more like a C. I will be linking this in the, in the I will be linking this in the description box down below. So make sure you guys size down if you're choosing to get this bra. I've had it for over a year now and I think the stickiness is starting to wear off. So yeah, it's definitely not like a forever investment purchase. I think it's only like $8 or something, but it does last you quite a while. Wow, I really, really like this next dress. It's the first time I've tried it on and I am so impressed. It's a black spaghetti strap midi dress. It does look kind of on the formal side, but like at this point, I don't even care because it is so comfy. I definitely think this will be like my go-to summer dress along with the blue tie-dye one because I just freaking and love that one to death but this one is like your more like sexy kind of like nighttime date night summer dress it's almost knee length and it has a slit on one side fabric is like a jersey stretchy kind of cotton fabric so it's not a ribbed material but it still has got some stretch to it can you guys see if it's see-through if i stretch it i think 
it's not that see-through and there's so much room around the tummy area so again very very bot friendly or food baby friendly it looks like it will be very skin tight and like body con material and like super uncomfortable but it is not you guys highly highly suggest this oh my god okay so the only thing i don't like about it is that the straps are not adjustable in any way i mean they're kind of stretchy though so there's that but definitely keeping this piece babe can you come Do you like this dress? I love it! You're, I you're, love it. you're on record. Oh. <laughs> Would you date me? I would put a baby in <laughs> What was I talking about again? I got another black midi dress. Um, this one is a halter top black midi dress. And I got this in the size US 6. So same as the first black midi dress. But this one feels a lot tighter for some reason. So sizing wise not completely consistent first thing i noticed was that this area here at the chest is very loose fitting so if you happen to have smaller boobs then this area will feel kind of weird like it would kind of sag and like jut out from the side which is not that flattering but then boobs downwards it starts to get kind of tight so yeah not sure if it's because of baby currently being this size but it does feel a lot more constrictive than the one with the side slit so i would definitely say this one is more of like a nighttime sort of going out dress made for the same material though so it's like a really comfortable material light stretch not too much but let me know which one you guys like better this dress or this dress over here and then our two pieces I should just rename this whole haul to like two piece sets. This is a very sexy two piece set. I think it's perfect for going out purposes. Um, if you want to like go party, you know, like for your plans or party for your fridge. These two comes in a set. So I got both these in size US 6. And not gonna lie, it was really tight on me. I got this because the model made it look balls, And it was such a unique design. I've never seen anything like that. So strappy with like high rounds all over the place so i tried it and it was kind of confusing to get to at first once you get the hang of it it's pretty straightforward so these are just one shoulder and then you can cinch this part in on the bottom here and then the skirt comes pretty high waisted with these tie details that you just like wrap around the top part of your waist i do have to mention that it is extremely short though even though i like the fact that you can pair the skirt with other stuff in your closet it is a relatively shorter skirt so definitely a party skirt in my opinion and if you don't like the strings at the front here you can always just tuck them in at the front so this becomes a much more wearable skirt so kind of more versatility there okay guys that is for this boohoo haul let me know which one is your favorite which ones i should actually keep i'm definitely gonna keep this blue one because it is my absolute favorite um but yeah let me know about the other ones thanks for watching and i love you all so much bye Ugh, boobies, stay, is not <laughs> the stay. Brush always? I think, oops, oh, I need a drink.